Well, hi there, my name is Nathan Kordiaka. I am with E There Live. We are the streaming and broadcast division of Soundbox Productions here in Hamilton, Ontario. When you're organizing a virtual event, it can be pretty overwhelming with all of the options. There's a ton of different ways you can do this stuff. And so what we wanted to do was just kind of break down one of the many strategies you can use uh, depending on your context, whether this is uh, you know, a one-off episode, maybe it's a half-day conference, or maybe it's a all-out three-day, you know, multi-day conference with a, a lot of different speakers. So today we're going to look at one example. Uh, this is a kind of a full-fledged uh, virtual platform. Um, and now one thing to keep in mind, I will preface it by saying we are not a platform. We are a production company. And the beautiful thing about that is that we can leverage any kind of platform that best suits your needs uh, based on, you know, depending on your event. The goals you have, what you need to accomplish, the way you want it to run, um, we are not stuck with one specific platform. So that's the great thing about that. We're not going to force a specific platform on you. In this example, we're looking at a platform called Feedloop. Now we're looking at this because we just have had really good experience with them, really good support, and the cost to feature ratio is really good. It's really reasonable platform, um, and we've just had a really good experience with it with multiple clients. So this one here is the BIAF conference. Uh, you can see the live stream right in here. We're using a two box, um, and we were basically we were switching, uh, this is an in-studio uh, production, so they actually um, had all of their speakers come in in person, and so we had a, a, a presenter set and an MC set. So two sets running simultaneously, and we would switch between multiple cameras for each set. So while the MC was introducing the next speaker, we were basically socially distancing all the speakers so they would just have a basically a little a track to, to loop around in so nobody was ever too close or, or meeting up. Um, and so you can see here they're controlling their slides. Uh, we've got a slide feed in the control room and we're feeding this into the platform uh, while they are chatting in the session chat. Now when we look at the lobby, you're going to see uh, basically right in the middle we've got um, We've got a pre-roll. This is actually a video that's looping with different uh, sponsors. We can see how many people are online right at this very moment. Uh, we've got our diamond sponsors, which is kind of a rotating banner. So no matter what page we click into, we've always got some sponsor value happening there for our top exhibitors, our top sponsors for the event. Now, if we go into exhibit hall, uh, basically for this conference, their bread and butter was the exhibitors. This is where, you know, this is who's really paying the upfront costs of the, of the overall conference. And so we need to make sure we're bringing them a lot of value, uh, a lot of good leads, quality leads. And so Feedloop does a really good job of this, actually. They've got, uh, you've got the exhibit hall with, which lists all of the different exhibitors. Each one has its own booth. So you can put a banner in, you've got uh, the social links and contact. You've got the reps down there at the bottom, which you can start a live chat with at any time throughout the conference. And each booth actually has uh, an exhibitor chat. So there's a couple different ways the booth can actually interact with people throughout the conference. Uh, one is obviously through the chat and just chatting with people. Um, you know, uh, Christine and Kamal can, can chat and, um, basically have conversations in there. One really cool thing about Feedloop is that they actually have a join live button. And what that actually is, is a, it's, a, it's a video booth within their exhibitor booth. So much like being in person, you know, you stop by a booth and you see each other and you chat. This allows uh, attendees to actually hit the join live button. So a lot of exhibitors were actually sitting in there. It's, they don't have to leave the platform. It's all right within uh, the Feedloop platform. And they can actually show a demo of their product. They can be doing draws or giveaways, ways to uh, create engagement with the attendees, okay? 
Another way to really engage with attendees and kind of encourage that is through something called gamification. So if you've never heard that before, basically all it is is uh, basically you're just kind of turning engagement into a bit of a game. And so there's different ways you can earn points. So in this context, they had promo codes hiding in some of the exhibitor brochures or white papers. They had codes um, actually in the sessions. So about three quarters of the way through a presentation, a lower third would come in across the screen with a specific promo code. So the more sessions you watched, the more promo codes you got, the more points you got. And so throughout the conference uh, live on the, on the broadcast, they were tallying points. And once you hit a certain threshold, your name got put into a draw for like, they were giving away like a thousand dollar gift card and all kinds of different prizes. So really unique and a really unique way to kind of build that engagement. Again, they're trying to, when people engage and interact with the exhibitors, those exhibitors get those leads um, afterwards. So they can pull those, those emails, those profiles, and actually reach out to those people individually. So really bringing a lot of value uh, to their vendors and their exhibitors, their sponsors. So let's take a look at networking. Um, you know, most of the platforms all have some sort of networking ability, right? So um, it's going to create a default look for each profile. And then basically attendees can log in and change their profile picture, their title, their contact information, social links, all that kind of stuff. You can actually start a chat uh, a private chat right within the platform that then opens the door to be able to start a video call with uh, the person you're chatting with right within the platform. Again, we don't want, we don't want to uh, have people leaving the platform and then it's a challenge to actually get them back in. We want them to stay with all within the platform. So a really nice option there. Uh, you also have the ability to create networking groups or kind of uh, chat rooms or video rooms. So people can actually go into the, into the networking group. Uh, I think up to 25 people can actually join live audio and video right within the platform. So really nice, really nice uh, feature there. And last but not least, we have uh, registration. So it's possible to, they, you know, they have the ticket purchases, uh, different levels of tickets, uh, or if you're not selling access but you need registration, they have that as well. Now, BIAF was, uh, and maybe this is, this is relevant to you, the, uh, they had an in-person conference already planned, so they already had existing registrations. So all we did was we take that, uh, that list of registrations, upload it into Feedloop, and it creates all those attendee profiles right within Feedloop. Uh, so you don't have to use it, but it's there if you need it. So that's kind of an overview. I know there's a lot of information there really, really quickly, uh, but that kind of gives you, you know, hopefully it gives you some idea of what this can look like. A lot of the platforms are, really the bones are the same, but you do get uh, some customization to it um, and the different levels of uh, features that you're gonna purchase. Um, again, Feedloop is just one of many options. Uh, if you already have a platform, we can, utilize it, we can leverage that and really make sure that your broadcast is uh, great quality, it looks great, looks polished and professional. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out. We're here to help anytime.